Abby's away this week, so I'm here for Pet Project with Nicole. It's always great to be here, Nicole. Thanks yes, for talking with nice me. Seeing, yeah. And today we're talking about this handsome little guy, Pee Wee. Tell us a little bit more about him. So yeah, Pee Wee's about two years old. He's a domestic long hair. Um, he just came in as a random stray from Lloyd. So he's all neutered and up to date on his vaccines. So he's ready to go home today, actually. He's very sweet, very cuddly. Yeah. Seems to be really good with kids of all ages, as well as other animals. We haven't had any issues. Um, he gets along great with the other cats. I'm not 100% sure about dogs, but I think he seems pretty chill, but yeah. slow introduction. He He'd be fine. Yeah, he'd get cool with it super easily. Cause just look at him right here. Look how <laughs> calm he is. He just wants to be loved and get those cuddles and snuggle with his owner. Uh, talk to me a little bit about the adoption process for someone who's uh, possibly coming in here to look for him or any of the other cats that are in here. Yeah, so it's pretty easy. You just go onto our website mm -hmm. um, and then you can fill out an application and then we just call a couple references, make sure it's a good fit. Usually takes a day or two and then you can come and pick up your new fur baby. I love to see just how much he's cuddling, so, so relaxed. <laughs> uh, talk to me a little bit about um, the amount of cats do, that you guys have right now. Is there? Um, good, I'm sure you always come and get a lot are coming in, hey? Yeah, no, we have quite a bit. Like, I know we have a bunch of kittens in foster care. Like, I'd say we probably have about 40 to 50 kittens in foster care right mm -hmm. now. So in a couple of weeks, all of those guys will be coming back, so we'll be extremely full. But if you're looking at for a kitten, we've got every single kind of kitten you can imagine. So yeah, we are quite full. I know last week with dogs and cats, we were at 110 animals in our care wow. between us as well as foster. I feel like it's gone up a little bit. So yeah, we're probably sitting about 115 for cats and dogs in the shelter right now. So there now. you go. There's a lot of animals <laughs> that are here at Border Paws that are looking for a forever home. So make sure you come down here and check out because there's something for everyone, it seems like. Absolutely. In here, we have this beautiful cat condo. People can come in here and hang out with the cats. But talk to me a little about um, different uh, volunteer opportunities, actually. and. Um, because people of all ages can do that, right? Yeah, so our volunteer program, we've got something for every age, depending yeah. what you like, if you wanna just come hang out with the animals or if you want to actually get involved with more of the um, taking care of them. So that's like feeding, cleaning, walking the dogs, all that kind of stuff. So yeah, if you are interested, you can go to our website. There's some information there and yeah. also to fill out an application as well as we started a volunteer Facebook page. So anybody who's on Facebook, you can go and join that group and then it will kind of let you know different stuff that we need, the kind of help we need, as well as all the different events we'll need help with. Because awesome. I mean, a lot of our events are volunteer run. So yeah, it's kind of just a easy way to find out what we're needing. And yeah, if you just want to come in and get a two or two, you yeah. can always do that. We do, if you're under 16, you do have to be accompanied by a parent, but you can bring all ages. There you go, it can be a whole family thing. Is Absolutely. there any time commitment though with that? No, so uh, if you wanna do a half an hour once a week, we have no time commitment. If you wanna come every day, that's fine with us too. Perfect. So it's kind of nice, there's no set hours or anything. It's whatever works best for you and your lifestyle, so. And we're in, uh, the. there's no school on right now, but it seems like it would be a great uh, kind of volunteer opportunity for those school kids that need to get their hours in or something Absolutely. like that. Absolutely. Anybody who needs hours, I mean, I know when I was in high school, I used to do them the summer before. That yeah. way I was already done. So yeah, we any kids want to get their volunteer hours, please come stop by. We've got lots to do. Also, another thing I'll mention with volunteers yeah. too is uh, it's called uh, Book Buddies. It's where we actually have the children come and read oh, to the cats or the dogs. It's so adorable. So yeah, if anybody wants to brush up on their reading and they want to come read to these guys, they're great listeners. Amazing. And who wouldn't love to come and hang out with these <laughs> cute little pets here at Border Paws Animal Shelter? Pee Wee, one last time. Such a good animal for us here, such a good cat, behaving so well. Please come and take him home. He's looking for his forever home. Nicole, thanks again for talking Thank with you. us today.